hi everyone welcome to sk technologies so in this tutorial i will explain you about scanning tool which is sonar cube very popular tool in the real time environments so most of the people are using the scanning tool as a sonar cube so very popular tool so i will explain you what is this scanning tool what does it exactly it will do and what are the benefits of with, with this tool and how to installation and how to create a project and how to make the source code scanning and how to generate the reports and what is the architecture of the sonar cube so what are the prerequisites before going to installation so all these things i will explain in this video so for your convenient so i will make some splits of the total video then accordingly i will upload so you can watch one by one then get familiar with the scanning tool okay so in this tutorial in this session i will just explain this what is this scanning tool and i have a stanza actually so if you are following this stanza easily you can remember the all the devops tools so i will explain in this video only this so later we will see architecture and we will see the installation funnel okay so scanning tool basically after developing the source code by the developers so we are supposed to build that bundle with help of the source code thereafter we are directly not supposed to deploy our application because we cannot trust the developers right directly so how they followed the standards okay and how they maintain the uh, standards in the source code and uh, what is the code coverages uh, and the duplicates codes uh, and especially there are uh, three terms guys like uh, code smells uh, bugs uh, and vulnerabilities so these are the things uh, we have to taking care we have to take care of this uh, all these things uh. so with the help of this scanning tool uh, so we will with the help of this scanning tool so we are taking care all of all these things okay so sonar cube is a very popular tool so which will supports for many languages java dot net c hash rubel scala so many languages it will support and it will go through your source code and based on your conditions it will generate the sonar report okay so let me explain these things and we will write the values for this checklist also okay so the main purpose of this tool to generate the sonar report okay so we know right tool name is sonar cube and the main purpose if you write in a single sentence to generate the okay so to generate the sonar report okay with the help of the report we'll come to know we'll get to know what is the code smells what is the code coverage percentage how many duplication code is there and uh, vulnerabilities reports and bugs report okay and the j unit test cases reports everything uh, uh, should be available in this sonar report okay and uh, versions so there is 7.x version or 8.x version and 9.x this is the 9 point is the latest one i think 10 also they released we will walk through the official page also so sonar cube documentation available in the sonar cube site okay you can open any browser then you can simply type download sonar cube this is the link so here this is the official page to download so click on the documentation so you will come to know all these details what are the prerequisites everything they documented you can go then say minimum 2 gb is required for the installation okay so hardware level installation hardware level prerequisites and the software level prerequisite everything they documented okay so we will see all these things uh, during the installation so prerequisites that's it for this video so we will be continuing in the next video we will see installation and architecture okay thank you guys